Home cooking has defined the last two weeks for the Ohio softball team. I'm Bobcat Showcase reporter Michael Roth, and Ohio improved to 6-1 at OSF on the season this afternoon. Ohio jumped on Northern Illinois early. Katie Young hit Allie Englet to third base, and then Natty Alvarez drove Englet home with a sack fly. Ohio held on to that 1-0 lead in the fourth inning when Katie Young threw a Husky out at home to preserve the shutout. Ohio doubled their lead when Morgan Gino went yard for her 13th home run of the season. Northern Illinois would then get on the board with this double off the wall from Katie Keller. The Huskies would then add another run to tie the game at two in that inning. Ohio got the lead back when Katie Young drove in Caroline Spachek with a single. Natalie Alvarez doubled Ohio's lead with a double. And then who else? But Morgan Gina would put Ohio up 7-2 to with this three-run blast. It was attack mode. We couldn't be complacent because we needed to score more, obviously. So um, I think Carol started that off, and she got on. So she everyone just bought into it, and then it was like a effect, and it just kept going and going and going. That would be all the runs McCready would need, especially defense like this from Deanna Cole. The Bobcats would tack on one more run on an Alexa Holland sack bunt, and that would be more than enough for Ohio. Despite giving up two runs in the seventh inning, Maddie McCready finished her third complete game outing this week. Um, we're just talking about right now rest, rest, rest until we got to go out there and fight again, and that's what she said. She said if you're not resting enough, rest more. Rest more if you think you got enough, rest more. The Bobcats win 8-4 and advance to 5-1 and in MAC play and 6-1 and during the seven-game homestand. <laughs> I think they're comfortable on the road. I, I love playing in front of our home crowd, but I think they're looking forward to kind of getting back into what their routine was. Bobcats return to the Diamond on Tuesday, April 2nd, when they make a trip up north to Kent State. They won't be back home at OSF until April 10th, when the Golden Flashes make their return visit to Athens. For Bobcat Showcase, I'm Michael Roth.